Mobile Public Works crews are nearly a week behind on picking up curbside trash piles, all because five of their 16 trucks are broken down and unrepairable. NBC 15's Justin Moore joins us now live. Justin, the director of Public Works says between the pandemic and last year's active hurricane season, it put a lot of stress on their aging equipment. Yeah, Kim, and another issue is the city ordered six new trucks in 2020 and still waiting for them. Six to seven days a week, 10 plus hours a day is how long some Mobile Public Works crews are working. They're trying to get as much curbside trash picked up as quickly as possible. We're asking citizens, if you can hold off for a little bit and not put stuff out right now, that helps. Mobile Public Works Executive Director Jim DeLapp says crews are six and a half days behind pickup schedule, which has them under the gun. The reason is five of the trash trucks with the mechanical arms are permanently broken down. So we used the equipment almost twice as much last year as we would normally. The amount we picked up was nearly double what we do in a normal year. And so that really just wore the equipment out. The lab says the city ordered six new trucks in June of 2020. With the pandemic and the delay in truck production because of microchip shortage, it could take up to 18 months before they are ready. We anticipated them coming in this month. Uh, once they do, we expect to then be able to work to quickly get back on schedule. The city is trying to deal with this issue in multiple ways, including setting up trash drop off sites, also posting pickup routes on social media and online 24 hours ahead of time. We don't anticipate with the amount of equipment we have, we'll be able to get back on schedule until the new equipment arrives. And if you want to keep your neighborhood looking clean like this one behind me, uh, to find out those uh, trash drop-off sites and the trash routes, go to my NBC 15 news, my NBC 15.com. Live in Westmobile, Justin Moore, NBC 15 News.